It's the NFL on EA Sports, and we are at Highmark Stadium in upstate New York. Today, we've got a compelling AFC matchup for you, as it'll be the L.A. Chargers taking on the Buffalo Bills. And we are underway in Buffalo. And they'll get him down inside the 30 at the 27. Here's Eckler to begin the drive. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. But you often say that sort of opens the playbook now, second and short. What do you think, early shot here? I like where you're going. Obviously, we've been together for a while because you know me. I want to take that shot early and loosen things up. Now left side, a completion to his tight end. He's got room at the 30, and he gets this one down to the 24. A big change in field position there. That's 40 yards on the catch and run. All right, Charles, let me put you in the head of one of those defenders out there. You have a big play like that go against you so early. What Does that shake your confidence? It shouldn't, but it often does because your thought process all during the week is how you're going to get after that offense and make your plays. And when they make one against you, Makes you a little bit hesitant. Time to regroup. And he's brought down, but he has it down to the 12 on a pickup of 12. First and 10. Well, there's plenty of real estate for him to maneuver on that run. And let's face it, it shouldn't be a surprise. He's one of the better backs in the league. Had to come into this game with the idea. Slow him down. Otherwise, it's going to be a long afternoon. So give him five yards there on the pitch and catch. And that'll make it second down. Herbert will give this one to Eckler. And he's brought down right at the five-yard line. Give him two on the play. The heavy set out there. Three tight ends in the formation for third and three. And he won't be close to a first down as he runs into a wall right around the line of scrimmage. Here we go on fourth. Herbert, and it's caught. And the Chargers are going to have first and goal as they try to finish off this drive with six points. First and goal, a chance for an early statement here on the road. Kelly is not going anywhere. He'll be hit and dropped for no gain at the two-yard line. Second and goal, and they will try again from the two-yard line. And they'll try again down here with Kelly. And he's going to get this back to the three-yard line and no further. This Buffalo defense has stood their ground. This is third and goal. Now Herbert with it looking to pass. Flush to his right. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. So they opted to pass for it on third and goal. Let's see what they do on fourth and goal. Yeah, I think they threw it with the idea that if they didn't get it, they would go for it on fourth and goal. So they got another play in their pocket. They're going to have to call it right now. All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. And the Bills are going to get possession here as they force the opening drive turnover. Allen and the Bills now with a first and 10 at the 39-yard line. Throwing to start the drive. Allen, that's caught by his tight end, Dawson Knox. First down yardage on the first play of the drive, giving 14. And what a nice example there of a tight end doing exactly what he needs to do. How about how he worked his way to the outside, made sure he secured the catch, and then anything after that, we count that as a bonus, and indeed, he gets enough for the first down. Throwing on first down is Allen. Going right back to Knox, and again a completion. Consecutive catches for him. That good for 11. No score after one on EA Sports. Back to back good plays have him on the move on first down. Goodness, 
They've come out locked in on this drive. Play calling, execution, they are fully in sync. Three straight passes, three first downs. They're moving the ball downfield almost at will. This defense really struggling to find the answers. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. Once you get into the red zone, space is at a premium for receivers to try and operate and shake themselves free. That one's incomplete. To throw, it's Allen. This is caught. Touchdown, Bills. Dawson knocks a touchdown grab from Josh Allen. And the Bills post the first points of the ball game as they take the lead here in this second quarter. As a general rule, quarterbacks don't want to lock in on a receiver before the ball is snapped. But in this case, based on the matchup he thought he was going to get, it was favorable for his tight end. He locked in on him early and found him for a touchdown. Extra point by Bass, up and good. And it's now a 7-0 game. After the touchdown, Bass to kick it away. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape up past the 30. The Charger drive about to get going. They threw an interception the first time they had the football, wound up leading to a touchdown the other way. How do you approach drive number two? Going back to your game plan coming in, everyone has matchups that they like better than others, where they think they have an advantage. Dial up some of those plays. Try and go to those spots and get your offense moving. And some nifty running here as he'll take this across midfield and down to the 47. 14 yards is the pickup there and a Charger first down. It's Eckler again. And he works his way forward to pick up four yards there, second down. And that was a quality play to start a new set of downs. That was simply an offensive line winning the battle up front and winning in a big way and giving their guy in the backfield a nice lane to hit. From the 43, here's second and six. Back to throw here, Herbert. And that is incomplete. And he's certainly not a guy that drops out football very often. Indeed, because that's a bit of a surprise. I know he's in the middle of some traffic, and people and bodies are around him, but he usually has the focus to haul that one in. A little short pass. This is Everett. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. A big third down pickup of 20 yards. Herbert on first down now. He'll get this out wide to Eckler. And he'll go out of bounds in the red zone just inside the 20. They'll wind up getting seven on the play, and it'll be second down. Two minutes on the clock, second quarter, 7-0 ball game. Again, Herbert. Eluding the pressure right. And able to get this down inside the 15, either the 13 or 14 before he's out of bounds. This will be the eighth play of the drive, and it's third and inches. Herbert now. Toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. I know we're just in the second quarter, and there's a ways to go in this game. But that's a second drop. I'm wondering if that's a little bit of an alarm bell for them when they start calling plays on the offensive side of the ball. His eyes already looking upfield on that last one before he brought it in. That's going to be complete to his tight end, Everett. And the Chargers are going to have first and goal as they try to finish off this drive with six points. A chance now to get even before the break as they come up first and goal. Eckler. Will get down close to the goal line, but not in, as he'll be marked down at the one. Second and goal from the one. He'll 
drop this one off to Apple. They get only a yard there. Now it's third and goal. That might feel like a little bit of a lost opportunity there for the offense because the defense brought pressure that time. And sometimes against that, you can get out to your running back, and it could turn into a big game downfield. But what a nice job they did getting to him quickly and holding him to a short game. This Buffalo defense has stood their ground. This is third and goal. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Los Angeles. Austin Eckler, a touchdown run there from a yard out. And the Chargers are on the board here in the final minute of the first half. Extra point up and good by Dicker. And that is going to tie our game as we approach halftime. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape up past the 30. Buffalo offense ready to go for their next drive. And they've got just under 50 seconds, so time enough to try to work their way downfield if they so choose. First down, and they're going to throw with Allen. Nice work to get seven out of that, and it's second down. Now the Bills are going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. On second down, Cook. And this won't be enough to pick up the first. A gain of two, third and one. Allen try to hurry everybody up to the line of scrimmage. In motion, the tight end. Allen looks to throw on third and one. He's got it complete to Stephon Diggs. Now the Bills will use the second of their timeouts as they stop it with 16 seconds to go in half number one. Here's Allen on first and ten. Uncorks one for Davis. And this is caught for a Bills touchdown. Gabriel Davis in the final seconds of the first half. And the Bills have taken the lead here in the final stages of this first half. So they're able to break the tie just before halftime. Now they just don't want anything crazy to happen on the ensuing kickoff. Yeah, they want to just add the extra point. Get the kickoff taken care of and get to the locker room with the lead that they fought so hard to get. An extra point by Bass, up and good. And that makes the score 14 to 7. So not much time to speak of remaining in this first half as the kick's away. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. The Charger drive about to get going. And with seven seconds remaining, not much time to really do anything. Meanwhile, Herbert's throw taken in by Palmer. And with just one second remaining in the first half, they'll call the timeout. The final shot before the break for Herbert. Try to lay one up deep. And his throw is incomplete. So we hit intermission. It's halftime. This is the NFL, and it's a presentation of EA Sports. Welcome back. Charles and I settled into the booth, ready for quarter number three. A one-touchdown ball game, 14-7. Our scores, we get back at it on EA Sports. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. The 
The Bills come to the line to start their next drive. This offense set to begin the third quarter, and Charles, if they had a checklist of things they wanted to accomplish in the first half, certainly at the top of that list would be having the lead, and they've got that here. That's always the most important box to check, isn't it? But also, they've had some success in their passing game, so probably an empty box establishing the run. They're on pace for fewer than 100 yards in this one, so now they want to make sure that they get that going so they truly have a control in this ball game and down the stretch, being able to be balanced, either throw it or run it and try and win this ball game. Now Allen throwing on second down. And Diggs has it. Finding room at midfield. And finally marked down at the 42-yard line. The catch and run, good for 24 yards. If you're going to blitz, likely going to leave you in man coverage with this guy, and that is less than I do. It is because just about any offense that has an elite receiver, if you blitz and have him in man coverage, you're going to him, even if he has an elite defender on him, because he usually knows where the ball is before the defender does. Allen's throw is complete. Back-to-back -back receptions for him, and it's another first down. former member of the Crimson Tide, Damian Harris. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. Damian Harris from 17 yards out. And the Bills take the opening kickoff in the third quarter and drive right down the field to extend their lead. And maybe that's the magic touch right there. They didn't use him at all in the first half, at least running the football. But here they entrust him with some work down in the red zone, and he responds. One carry, one touchdown. An extra point by Bass, up and good. And it's now 21-7. After the touchdown, Bass to kick it away. Yeah, they'll be set up pretty nicely here as they have it up to the 35-yard line. The Charger drive about to get going. And their deficit a little wider than it was at halftime. Does that touchdown a minute ago change the thinking here at all? I think it... Oh, it tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Tredavious White with a pick. Down the sideline he goes. And he is not quite going to make it all the 